All right. Shalom. Just, uh, uh, just the Akiya Shaquat Gabar from the GM at Charlotte Camp coming at you with another lesson. Before I get into this video, first I would like to give all praises to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai. Double honors to the apostles and elders at Great Millstone to rule well, teaching in the truth and sincerity. Shalom to the Akim that's in the ministry uh, on the highways and byways, doing work of the Lord and in the faith of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah. Shalom. Basically, man, I'm going to do a lesson, man, just getting into, you know, enduring, man. You know, and having faith, man, having confidence in the truth, man. You know, and have you know, and have faith and confidence in your how about Shem Yahweh Shah, man? Cause they're what brothers need, man, to get through the hardest times that's about to come, known as Jacob trouble, man. And and Jacob is you so-called Negroes, Latino, and Native Americans, which are the true Hebrew Israelites according to the Bible, man. And the times that we coming into is all the last days and the downfall of America, which in the Bible, America is known as Babylon. Nineveh, you know, uh, uh, Egypt, Sodom, and Gomorrah, you know, they're cold names, man, and the, at the end of uh, these days that the Lord is going to make his second coming, who the world early called Jesus Christ, which his name is Yahweh Shah in the Paleo-Hebrew, uh, before he come back and make his second coming and bring salvation to the elect of the nation of Israel, man. Because the Lord only coming to save the nation of Israel, starting off with the elect. And before he come back, man, it's going to be all type of chaos that's going to take place here in America and in different parts of the world, man. But mainly America, man. Because America going to be destroyed in this up and coming World War III by thermonuclear fire, man. By the hands of uh, these other countries, man, that got nuclear capabilities, man. And before that, man, you're going to have all type of atrocities that's going to take place, man. Like uh, famine, you know, lack of food, lack of water, you know, uh, diseases and pestilence, man. You know, race wars, uh, clash wars. You know, you're going to have all type of stuff, you know, disasters that's going to take place here in America, man. You're going to have different types of um, plagues with the weather, man. You know, with the, you know... And, and and just all type of chaos that's going to take place before you have a shot come back but brothers <clears throat> the ones in the truth man we haven't put in our confidence and our faith in uh you how about shim you shot man so we can be delivered praying to the lord that he can have fit to deliver us man for these times that's about to come man and the only way you can do that man is um building yourself up in the scriptures man you know so, brothers, you know, we just got to keep enduring, man. Keep fighting in the spirit, you know, to, to ask the Lord to give us that strength, man. But ultimately, man, ultimately, ultimately, the Lord is going to give us that power, too, man, to, to raise us up and 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 to defeat our enemies, man, which is you so-called whites, white people, you so-called, you know, Chinese, Japanese, you Africans, you Arabs, you know, Hawaiians, Samoans. All the uh, East Indians, all that you heed the nation, all you heed the nation that is against the nation of Israel, man. The Lord is going to raise up his elect man to put y'all in subjection, man, and, and have power and authority over y'all, man. So I'm going to get into the scripture about, uh, you know, just having faith and keep fighting, man. Uh, this is 2 Timothy 2 and 2. And the things that thou hast heard of me. I'm going to start off on no, Salaki, 2 Timothy 2 and 3. There are therefore endure hardness as a good soldier of Yahweh Shah Mashiach. Uh, so the Lord said, endure hardness, man, as a good soldier, man. So whatever brother's going through, man, you know, when you, the Lord also said when you're at a low state, man, take it cheerfully and be patient, man, to the Lord, you know, raise you up, man. So brothers might be going through, you know, catching hell, man. You know, dealing with their personal lives, you know, that they got to, you know, deal with. But when you come to Yahweh Bashim Yahweh man, the spirit, man, you got to pray to the Lord. They, they, they give you the strength to do all that, man. You know, because like I said, man, we're coming into some, some dreadful times, man. And you got to have that faith, man. 
praying that the Lord deliver us from this from this place and from out of well, you know from the destruction of America and out of the hands of our enemies, man. This is Hebrew eleven verse one. Now faith is the substance of things the hope for, the evidence of things not seen. So the faith, man, is something that you don't see, man, but you believe in it, man. Like we physically don't see uh, the Most High and His Son Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah, but we believe, man. We believe we have faith that the Lord do exist, man. That He is gonna come back and raise up the nation of Israel. You know that He is a so-called black man according to the Scriptures, man. That he is gonna give us power, give us the authority over these other nations, man. That the faith, man, he is going to don't deliver us from our enemies when it seems like, you know, we ain't got nothing else to um, go to or, or, or nothing else to do when the enemy come in on us, man. We got to have that faith, man. Because when you got that faith, man, the Lord is going to, you know, deliver you, man, because you, you believe on him, man. Let me see how I get on. Um Uh, uh, this is Isaiah 33 and 6 And wisdom and knowledge shall be the stability of thy times And strength of salvation The fear of the Lord is his treasure so the wisdom and knowledge is these holy scriptures, man. The the Bible, man. And knowing the spirit of Yahweh Bashim Yahusha, man. You know, that's gonna get give us the confidence, you know, to be delivered, man, in that time, man. The scriptures, man. The Holy Spirit, man. You know, knowing these prophecies, man. Knowing that the having a spiritual mind or knowing what the Lord is capable of, man. You got a lot of people in these you know, out there in the world that call themselves Christians. You know, they uh some even even some that call this some Israelites, man. You know, they even out here, you know, though they believe in the Lord, but they really don't know the power of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah, man. You know, because first you gotta have the name, and you gotta have the wisdom, knowledge, understanding, and the spirit of the scriptures dealing with you, man. You know, you just can't just go out there and say you know the Bible and and you don't believe in it, man. Or don't believe in the true understanding, the way that it ought to be taught and po we're supposed to be taught man how the elders and apostles a great millstone and the at great millstone break it down man you know because you got a lot of these groups out here talking about the lord on it you know the lord uh accepted the gentile which are the other nations when you look into the scriptures the other na the other gentiles that's in the new testament are the israelite foreigners man that lost their custom man you know that stopped taking on their custom of being an israelite it took on the customs of the of the Romans or the Greeks, the Africans, you know, the uh, East Indians. You know, they stopped they stopped taking on their custom and became uh, Gentiles by taking them on the heathen custom, man. So the Lord came back to die for them to bring them back into the fold, man. And that way you had the Jews, which are the so-called Negroes, you know, the Haitians and Jamaicans, man, doing them times, man, in the Rome and Greek. You know, that's why they didn't, didn't uh, accept them in the New Testament, man. You know? Because they, cause they left off they, from their heritage to join the heathen heritage. But those that believe in the, the word of Yahweh Shah, man, the Lord bring them back to the fold, man. You know, you got a lot of these groups out here talking about um, Esau can make it. So-called white man. When the scriptures say that the white man is not going to make it, that he was rejected, man. You know, you got... Um, all type of madness you got the groups out here talking about america is not babylon the great you know the babylon great is talking about you know uh the the, 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 uh, the vatican over there in rome well rome is the b system man it's part of the b system man america is the whore and america is the america is the whore that sit up on the beast and america is babylon man in the scriptures man if you got the spirit dealing with you man and you can see them things in throughout the throughout the Holy Scriptures. So the Lord said, "Where's knowledge going to be our stability of that time, man?" And what in them times of Jacob trouble when all hell break loose, 
the Lord willing, man, we keep the, the Lord keep the spirit of, you know, of him on us, man. And knowing the truth and the spirit of confidence, man, that we can be delivered from this hell, man. This is on um, This is on um, Psalms 34 and 7 The angel of the Lord Yahweh by Shem Yahushai account round about them that fear him and delivered them So the um so the angels man the Lord have his angels that's going to you know be around his men man you know, having been the hedge over his man of protection, man, from the times that coming, man. And, you know, that one in the way the Lord is going to have, you know, have his man delivered and protected by the angels, man. And, the, you know, the angels, they are the, basically our brothers, man, that, you know, in the, in the other spiritual realm, man, that the Lord have, have around us, you know, as we walk throughout our daily lives, man. You know, so the Lord, you know, it, you know, got a, a lot of power, man, that these people can't even fathom, man. They just put the Lord in a box thinking that the Lord just all about love, love. They don't even know that the Lord really control everything, man, but both good and evil, man. They don't know the power of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh man, and how, how dreadful the Lord is, man, and also how merciful the Lord really is. Because you got a lot of these people out here that say they believe in the Lord, you know, but they still continue on doing any wickedness, you know, and they don't really want to come back to the Lord and seek him for his mercy, man. And they're thinking that he a so-called white man, which that image of Chedre Borgia. You know, so the Lord is going to, you know, bring great destruction to this place. And the ones that believe in him, man, the elect, praying that, you know, brothers out there that doing this work, man. You know, praying that I'm part of the elect. That the Lord have his angels around us, man. Because that's what the Lord going to do, man. He's going to have his angels around his brothers. He's going to give his brother, or give the brothers, you know, his men spiritual power, man. The deliverance, man, to, to keep us from these dreadful times, man. Or deliver us from the time of Jacob trouble. Um, this is um, Psalm 71. And one, indeed, O Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, do I put my trust. Let me never be put to confusion. Deliver me in thy righteousness and cause me to escape. And claim, and claim thy ear unto me and save me. Be thou my strong habitation, whereto I may continue result. Thou hast given commandments to save me, for thou art my rock and my fortress. So the Lord, you know, this word, man, in Yahweh Bashim Yahushah, man, the spirit of the Lord is going to be our protection, man, be our guide, man. And the Lord, you know, when you look into the word uh, rock and fortress, mean a strong foundation, man. The Lord is going to build a strong hedge over us, man, and protect us from the hands of our enemy, man, and protect us from the time of, you know, a Jacob trouble and deliver us from this judgment that's about to take place in America, man. Um... Verse 4, deliver me, out, deliver me, O power, out of the hand of the wicked, out of the hand of the righteousness and cruel man. For thou art my hope, O Lord, Yahweh, by Shem Yahushai. Thou art my trust from my youth. So, you know, the Lord is going to protect this man, man. And, you know, and brothers, you know, you just keep fighting, keep pushing, man. Because the Lord truly is going to come back and deliver us, man. Praying, you know, that we part of that number, man. You know, so the next time I like to say, you know, all praises to Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah. You know, double honors to the apostles and elders at Great Millstone. They're teaching the truth and sincerity. And Shalom to the elect.